right. Okay, what is good everybody? This is Twinji from Caesar Graphics and today I'm teaching you guys how to uh, design simple mags and cover and um, let's just give one minute for people who are planning to, who are still trying to join the the training. Uh, people from my chat so I'm trying to invite people from my group so you guys can join us Please confirm if you can hear me and see my screen. Just drop a message in the chat box. Alright? Message in the chat box so as to let me know if you can see my screen. Um, let's see. anybody all right beautiful okay so um today um like i said previously i'm gonna be teaching you guys how to design um magazine cover all right because um, i was asked to do this um project um from one of um, my clients and so i received this brief from one of my clients excuse me and um i did make this a live training for you guys to learn how to um you know come up with uh, ma simple magazine cover so uh, this is going to be on social media and I'm going to use size I normally use for um, portrait Instagram at work all right and uh, please can you guys see my screen I think I think somebody's saying no we can't see your screen really but it's showing here that my screen is visible oh that's not cool that is not cool at all uh no so i can see the screen how come you guys can see my screen please can somebody else please um compare the same effect okay so so now i'm gonna just apply that now here then I'll click here and just gently apply this here now this should be above this layer I just do the same thing here do that there All right. good so uh, now it's covering the body of our model so what i'm going to do is i'm going to hide this and use the pen tool to crop the body of the um model select the pen tool now and i'm going to start from here you don't have to um select the crop the entire body we don't need that we only want the part where our background is touching on the body of the model so i'm just going to crop this out like so I'm sorry I noticed my internet is really messing things up here I'm looking forward to get a stable internet that won't make me go through this you know stress of experiencing lagging when I'm doing my live training so I'm just gonna push it here right here Right then, I'm going to 
just says and hit that I'm gonna hold down control and hit enter key to convert that to a marquee and I'll make this visible now then I'll hold down alt and click on the layer mask icon just to cut out this selection from the field background layer so I'm gonna click now and now you see we have um, this so I'm gonna bring in my text down so I'm gonna to go to the text tool and I'm going to bring the name of the mag which is rooted so I already have it typed here on my notepad so I'm going to paste it and the font I'm going to be using today is going to be machine bt all right then I'll bring out the free transform and scale this like so all right and this should be here and I'm going to make the color uh, blue just use something brighter okay so I, I I think this background is affecting the color here so what I'm gonna do is to select the layer of the background all right which is the fill underscore BG background and I'm gonna hit control L on my keyboard to bring out the levels all right so I want to brighten this I want to brighten it a bit all right and I'm going to push this to this side and I think this is fine and I'm gonna hit the OK button so you transform and just gently close this in like so all right then I can even move this down a bit okay now watch this you need to be very careful when you're doing this because um, the shape of your letters matters a lot all right when you tape most time it will affect the look and people may give it another um, you know meaning all right people may think it's another letter all right so you need to be care very careful not to tamper with the shape of your letters okay so for this I'm going to change the font to uh, Marvin Pro and I'll change the style to extra bold and I'll make everything cap. Excuse me, should be this. Sorry, should be this. All right, then I'll bring out the free transform and scale this down. And this should be here, like so. Then I'll change the color of front conference, but when I'm then I'm gonna scale it so I'm gonna scale it and position it here and I'm gonna close the lid in a bit so I don't see the text all right so to fix that I'm gonna make a new layer and I'll call this black glow then I'm gonna switch my foreground to black and click the OK button then I'm gonna select brush and click once then I'm gonna scale this real big with my free transform or with free transform all right I'm gonna click a enter key and reduce the opacity all right because we still want to be able to see the hand of the model so I'm gonna stop right now let's just reduce it a little bit more I think this is fine then I'll bring in the sub um, title of the message which is the under the hood so I'll copy that now and this should be under this then I'll change the fonts to Marvin Pro then I'll change the color to white and this should be somewhere around here like so all right this is looking too small so i'm going to scale it a little bit more and this should come down like this all right so since this is the purpose um the project we need to now make that a little bit bigger all right so after the name of the magazine we then we now go to the title all right then i'm going to 
who loads the tracker sorry i've been calling this the title this is not the title this is the magazine name okay um uh, pardon me okay i'm just trying to <laughs> I, i'm you know my mind is really on what i'm doing that's why so i'm going to just close the track the lead in a bit and this should go up with it and i am gonna make this rest on my guide like so then um the next thing i'm going to do is i need to put something like a tag all right so this tag is going to serve as what is going to call people's attention to know who and the magazine stuff all right or the magazine project so i'm just going to position that here then i'm going to put the name of um, the minister which is this and i'll now centralize it and this should be in here so like i said it's a church project but i'm asked to make it look like a magazine cover right so i'm gonna put this up 